What's up, everybody? It's your boy Brian Smothers with TheMindTheMind.com, and this is Cash. And you know, we talked, we've been talking about this a good bit lately, but oh, uh, again, you know, it's getting a little chilly outside. You know so, cuffing means. season is right around the corner. But you know, when people talk about cuffing season, they talk about finding someone. Yeah. Um, you know, getting a bathe when it gets a little chilly outside. But I feel like something important when you talk about that happens in cuffing season is sex, right? And a big thing that happens with sex, unfortunately for a lot of people, or STDs. <laughs> so we asked people what to talk about this week and they, you know, shout out to Nicole, she mentioned STDs <laughs> oh uh, and, or what we should talk about. So Cash, <laughs> first thoughts, what do you think? What are your thoughts on STDs? STDs? Get tested? Wrap it up? Why do you think a lot of people don't, do not get tested? Scared? You're scared? Nobody, it's like the little, it's the anticipation of like what is my response going to be like yeah it, it's true because i feel like you can know what your results are going to no, be but you are still not, like i don't think you necessarily know but like i know at like the lsu health center when you go get tested they call you with your results but they don't call you right away so it's like three to five days you're just kind of like oh no oh well, you're going limbo. to the wrong place because i go to the place 20 minutes and they let you know but I think what Free it just, but I'm saying, <laughs> but a lot of people are being safe out here. Um, with a, <laughs> a lot of people are you being safe. You said a lot of people are being oh, safe. I think so. At what least is, should what be. What is safe? Wearing protection and things like that. You think a lot of people being safe? That's another subject I think it might be for <laughs> no, another day. We own it. We All right, but it. Say, okay, so I feel like you can know that you are. Like I can, you can, you can know you did, took all the proper steps to being clean, but okay. still be scared as Yeah, you'll like, still be like... When you're there. Yeah. You'll be like, I ain't had like sex in three months. But you the just last think. time we wrapped up, but like, I, you never know. <laughs> also, so I, I think when it comes to STDs, it's kind of like going to the gym. Like, I feel like everybody needs to get tested, but to me, uh, getting tested is kind of like going to the gym. What's the hardest part about, going, about working out and losing weight? Actually going to the gym. Actually going. So I feel like my advice to a lot of you guys who... Do not know your status, which we're sure a lot of you guys and yeah, gals don't. Y'all don't, don't, don't know. Um, walk through the door. Like you have to you walk through the door. It. It's the hardest part. Once you're there, you're gonna go it's through with it. It's free most of the time on campus if you're still in college. And it's free at a lot of centers, you know. So getting tested is is is, is very important. Wrap it up too. Why do you think people don't? Use, why do you think people don't use protection? When they know <laughs> the STDs out there. You said, why do people not use protection? Yeah. Marit. Marit. Yeah. I mean, because condoms you're, are so no, easy to no. buy and they are... You're, you're a guy. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm not going to get all in your business. But men enjoy sex without a condom. So why do women, al why do women allow men to have sex without a men, condom? Women also enjoy sex without a condom. And uh, I think a lot of people, their fear isn't the STD. Their fear is the baby. Right, that's the big thing. Their fear <laughs> so, is the baby over the STD. They're like, oh, she not pregnant, so we good. But it's like, but she you, might have gave me something. Right, chlamydia. Uh, she might be the It's a lot of different things. I said chlamydia. No shade to anybody. But that's the first thing I thought of. <laughs> <laughs> I right, guess that's more guys. common. I think chlamydia is also more treatable. Like you just take like yeah. like four antibiotics and like it's gone. Because I think a lot of people think HIV, AIDS, but it's a lot of different STDs out there. Yeah, so you that you might not sure. even know that you have. Like I don't think there's immediate symptoms. So what would be your advice to somebody who just on the STD, uh, on the whole topic? What would be your advice to the people out there about getting tested, maybe, or just advice before they even get to that level? I would definitely ask the person that you're having sex with, like, when's the last time you got tested? And I have a good rule of thumb for that question. If it take you, like, real quick to respond, you probably lying. What? Yes! If I'm like, oh, when's the last time you got tested? Oh, two months ago. You didn't even think about it. Like, you know, you keep up with it. I feel like you would just be like, damn, okay. Or maybe they're getting a lot. A couple, and they just go regular It was races. like, I think a couple months ago. But, like, you're not going to just have an answer off the top. You're probably lying. I understand that. <laughs> okay, my advice is this is for guys. Oh, guys, I'm not going to say don't have sex because I know many of you out there are having sex. <laughs> you going to tell them to wrap it up? You can't. 
it, <laughs> my advice would be never have unprotected sex because once you do, you're never gonna want to wrap it up. Right. Again. I mean, what if it's too late? <laughs> but what I'm saying, I just already, know, I'm to, to like I know, I know a lot of people who are scared to death of having unprotected sex, and that's good because once you try for the first time, you're never gonna go back. It's like a white woman going getting some black. You, once you go black, you can never go back. Once you go unprotected, you never want to go back. So I mean, but what if they've already? That's not good advice. The people who are watching this probably have already gone that route. I mean, I know a lot of people who haven't had unprotected. I know that, before. but like the, to the people who have, what you want them to do? I want you to make sure you're getting tested. Um, to Regularly. start using condoms. Um, and <laughs> Regularly. Thing, like what Cass said, don't be afraid to ask the person to get tested yeah, with ask, you. Like, ask or the girl. To know if, their status. If you want to know, like this is my life you playing with at this point. Like if you were too scared to ask her. When the last time she got tested, then y'all probably don't need to be doing nothing. And if they're defensive when you ask them this, she you probably, think I'm dirty? Like you probably don't want to have sex <laughs> with them. <laughs> like, mm, show me the cat back. Not the cat back, but like the doctor. Okay, doctor back. That's a wrap, folks. <laughs>